Hello everybody and welcome. Thank you for joining me for another episode of Adventures of Chris. In the last episode, we finished up the tutorial level and we got to go over here to the tailor to see if we maybe we could pick up some armor before we head out into the first world. So let's see if we could, yeah, there we go. That was not too difficult. Welcome to Kingdom Outfitters. Hi, I'm Chris. I was told you could make me an awesome magic suit. Perhaps, what size do you wear? Large, I see. Sometimes extra large, depending on the brand. Well, this will probably need to be custom anyway. Okay, fine, two X large. <laughs> That's too funny. You know what? Why don't you pick out the fabric you want and I'll see what I can do. Okay, so we got, I guess we get a choice of green, kind of that brown, red, or blue. And normally I would say green. Green is my favorite color, but my favorite color of shade of green is a little bit darker than that. So I think I wanna have to go with this blue. Let's see if we could pick out. That's just ordinary blue cotton band. That's what I want right here. What is this? That one, a superb choice. That one has been treated with my latest creation. Tougher stuff. Tougher stuff basically cuts all damage in half. Also has the unpoppable treatment. Just 1600 cookies. Holy crap. I don't have 1600 cookies. What does this do? Now that fabric has my special tough stuff treatment. It reduces all damage by 25%. Also has an unpumpable treatment, a mere 700 cookies. I don't even have 700 cookies. What does this have? Nice choice. That fabric features my special unpoppable treatment. Wearing the sharp objects will wound rather than pop. Only 100 cookies. I could do that. Now this one, it won't even let me buy the blue one. Okay, so it looks like we're going for the green, the green one. The green one anyways. Okay, so. We will get that for 100 cookies. Let's see what we can do. Okay, so we're gonna have a, like a green. Okay, I'm unpoppable. A green superhero. Oh, it just turns my shirt green. Okay, awesome. Well, let's, I guess the next thing to do, I don't think there is, there's a puppy. I'm a little worried about the puppy. Oh, okay, there's a baker down here. Ooh, I come on in friend. Mystic Bakehouse is always open. Mmm, that smells great. I think this might be my new favorite shop. We bake all varieties of magical sweets and desserts here. All uh, enhancing your abilities. Okay, take a look around. Okay, so what do we got? We got my luscious strawberry shortcake adds to your maximum health. It says 150 cookies. That seems like a lot. It is a lot. You know, it's possible I'm the cough hero of lost balloons. <laughs> The hero, well, my friend, why didn't you say so? The price is now 250 cookies. Oh man. Hey, hey, supply and demand, my friend. Take it or leave it. You should have kept your mouth shut. Okay, well, I can't do any of this. My delectable boogie line pie increases max maximum magic. You need to know magic to buy this one. Okay, well, what does this one do? Special blue cola float raises your maximum helium level. Oh, I can do that. Cola float, yeah, sure, why not? Let me wrap that up for you. Okay, so we're down to one cookie. I don't think, oh, I'm hold, holding on. That's kind of cool that it like, let me hold, hold on to the sign, that's funny. Now can I like, that would be hilarious if I could climb up there. Okay, is there anything else down here? Oh, there's a bookshop. Welcome to the public library and education center where we all love to learn. Any returns? Don't think so. Is that an encyclopedia set? Yes, that Skybook series, but sadly we're missing several volumes. I love reading the encyclopedia. My favorite volume is Essay to Arsene. That's too funny. If you ever see any missing volumes in your travels, please return them here. We really need them back. Sure thing. Okay, so we got a little side quest kind of thing is to uh, get the books. I like that they have little balloons back here reading. That's kind of cool. I don't know if I want to punch the books. Oh, I could look at the books. That's interesting. Does it like give me information if I click on them? Uh, wait. Yeah, it doesn't seem to actually give me any kind of information if I click on them. 
Okay, so I guess we go up to the map now and the first thing the little oh whoa, 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 the guy told us to do that helped us out in our training what is that that's the citrus club there's all kinds of interesting stuff in here wow okay hey man what's up hi i'm chris you collect flags i've got a little bit of a collection started yeah I love flags. I collect them myself. I got them from all these different countries. Hey, that's pretty <laughs> rad, man. You traveled the world a lot or something. Mostly Epcot Center. <laughs> that's great. I hear ya, I hear ya. Yay, aren't you the guy who thinks he's the hero? Um, I guess. Maybe you could do me a little favor then. While you're out traveling the world saving everybody, could you pick me up a flag from each country you visit? I will try. Huh. I'll see what I can do. Okay, so it looks like there's actually a lot of people in here I could visit, but we're gonna head up onto the world. Ooh, he looks sad. He looks very sad. Why are you so sad? Are you, can I talk to you? Oh dear, oh dear. What seems to be the trouble? The great windstorm blew my precious puppies all over Main Street. I only have one left, and if I leave, he'll escape too. Well, I could be of service. I don't know. Do you think you might possibly find someone who could round them up for me? Maybe I could round them up for you. Oh, I didn't mean to. I mean, I sure you could, but I wouldn't want to trouble you. I'm going to round up those puppies, dag nummit. Be careful with them, please. I treasure my precious puppies. Okay, well, there was a puppy over here, but how do I pick it up? Gotcha. Okay, awesome. This seems to be working out well for us. Okay, well, there's one puppy. There's one of them. Okay, let's see. This is Main Street, so I guess the... Oh, did I see another one down there? Nope, that's a guard. We have to be careful. I wonder how many puppies he has. Now I'm on a puppy catching adventure, and I didn't really mean to be, but okay. I can handle this. We can get up here. We've got to go up and around, it looks like. Okay. Oh, I just punched the puppy. Oh, there we go. Come on. Come on, get in here, puppy. Did Is that all of them? How many more do you have? How many little puppies? Oh, there's another one. Okay. I hope that's, I think that's all of them. It's gotta be pretty close to all of them because there we, oh, my precious puppies. They're all back. Yep. They sure are. I'm sorry. Did you want something? Oh no. I mean, I wasn't expecting you to give me, you know what? Actually, I do have something for you. Yes. Yes. While you're out, would you kindly return this library book? Sure thing. <laughs> That's too funny. Okay, the library was over here. So let's return this library book really quickly. Welcome to the public library and education center. Okay, yep, I got to return. Awesome. You may come in and read anything you like, but no checkouts at this time, please. So now let's go up to the, before we get sidetracked again, up to the world map. And the first thing we're supposed to do is go to Mexico. We want to go to Mexico because that's where the fire magic was. And that was where I was told to go first because we need to learn fire magic. Oh, awesome. Okay. I got to say that the animation and the enemies are extremely, extremely well done in this game. Very impressed with, can I punch? Oh, nobody can roll though. Ah, yeah, there we go. I got that bat out of my way. Can I get, okay, let's see what else. I love the artwork here. Can I stand on these? I can, okay, well, that's a good thing to know. So those, oh, whoa, okay, that's why they were there. So they not only block me from going up, which is cool, it also allows me to stand on them and refill my balloon. Now, can I get on the, okay, I can't get on top of those trees, but these leaf branches, I can. There's that spider again. Oh, I love that spider. That spider is like the most coolest thing ever, I think. There's some more. Oh, there's another spider up there. I gotta watch out for the spiders. Oh, and I gotta bend down, it looks like, for the spiders. Like, I gotta bend down to punch them. You know? Let's get these guys out of my way first, and then we'll come back for the cookies. Oh. I should be able to drop. There we go. Drop and then refill because I picked up that... Now I should be able to look there. There we go. Now that's one of the nice things about this game. 
is that it allows a so if i'm up here i could actually look down now that wasn't far enough but if i'm when i was up here i could look down and it'll show below me and i can look up and see what's above me which is a really cool effect and really nice addition to the game oh and my super power punch is working out well for us oh I, i'm a little afraid of going down there too far oh i don't know how much of a drop the how much of a like a momentum drop there is when i'm falling and i hit the balloon so will it stop me immediately it does appear to stop me immediately i didn't know if there was like a a momentum a momentum bit to it it seems pretty quickly oh there's a flag can i get in there i really wish i could get in there can i roll in there maybe i'll need a special i don't know a special ability to shrink or to roll or to deflate more or to break that wall apart there has to be something i could do to get in there oh, oh we got a bat this is gonna be fun so i'm not going to be able to oh but now i'm out of balloon so i'm a bit of a pickle here how am i supposed to get over that i'm not sure hopefully we can run run it through run oh we didn't <laughs> i was looking at my balloons and not my health so how am i going to get over the ah shoot well that didn't help me any oh shoot. this is not going well i gotta say wow this is a really interesting little section here i got him so i could drop down and grab that but now i'm all out of oh come on i'm not doing oh wow i messed up maybe this is not the best way to go there's something Okay, right, we got rid of the bat so let's see if i could drop back down here i got all my balloons if i drop i'm i'm stuck up here but i need i need to somehow get further than what i can right here because i'm stuck at this point unless i get another suit I, oh this is not going well yeah i almost got through it <laughs> in a in a very bad sort oh shoot that's not gonna let me get through it now i'm gonna need more than that to get through it i believe but i don't think this is the way, way to go uh, i'm not sure if i oh yeah, frig i've got to not get hit that first time if i ever want to be able to get through it okay right, well we got that okay so now i could drop get punched tied up here oh run i'm oh and i get it ah, there we go we made it through it not the best way probably but i did make it through it now i really need some health that was very badly done i gotta say it was a poor way i know it was the poor way to do it but is there anything up here whoa there is that was kind of scary i was i was not ready for that bat to be there some spider so we're gonna watch and go up and see if we can find cookies and stuff as well because there does appear to be a lot of things that we could find in the oh gosh two of them oh that's kind of cool like hidden in the trees almost we just gotta watch out for everything i only have one health left and i really need to have a sunday i can go up or down i'm not sure which way is the better way to go oh there's a sunday definitely need that where did that bat go okay there he is there was i don't want to go down i'm gonna go up and though spider now will that frog i wish i could punch down that would be kind of cool but i don't think i can like yeah there's no kind of down way i think maybe what i was supposed to do was get the one 
that ha was unpoppable, but I did make it through there, which is good. Now I kind of want to double back here and see if I can get it. Eh, I don't know about that. Maybe I don't want to double back there. That doesn't look fun at all in that cave. I think I went the right way. Let's just real quickly run back and see if there is something that might be yeah this is all spikes oh it's not as long as i thought okay there we go we're gonna go we can do this there we go nice okay i'm getting the hang of this a little bit better in the momentum let's look at this we got a little bit further way to drop so if i drop oh oh i almost got that spider there okay let's there's another bat why are the what's up with all the bats i'm trying to look at the momentum if i'm falling there is, seems to be a little bit of a momentum drop but not much so it's pretty close to when i hit the balloon it's going to bring me back up yep there's some more four more cookies hey i'll take them huh hello is someone there well that means when you have like is something that we're in any game it's never good to have something that will refill all your health so there's three milkshakes there so no matter what happened right here i would have four health and that really worries me because i know what's in this next room it's going to be a boss there's going to be some kind of boss in this room or very soon or something that's a little bit more tricky okay it looks like it's just shooting fire but does give me a little bit of a warning kind of lights up a little bit before it does that so that's going to be helpful look there's a little bit of an exploration oh gosh press right stick to look up yeah okay so it does give me a chance and there was a okay you can see them that was very close and it was kind of hard to see I'm afraid to try to get those. Ah, I didn't hit it quick enough. Hey, whoa. Get up, get up. Oh, yeah. We've got to be really careful here. There is a lot of stuff already trying to kill us. I need another milkshake. And I don't see any more milkshakes. Can I go up further? I can. And nope, I can't. Oh, man. I like that my glasses fall off when I die. That's kind of cool. Okay, so let's see if we can not die here. That would be thing point one. I'm curious what's up here. If it's a whole nother area or almost seems like a little bit of a Metroidvania here now that we have this open world to explore, which is cool. I, I like it. There's definitely things I can't. Now I can't do that. I got to fall. Whoa, run, 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 run. Ah! <laughs> oh, gosh. I chose the wrong way. Just keep running. No, not down. I didn't want to do that. Run. I didn't want to bend down. Nope. Oh shoot, run. Okay, keep on going. I got this. We can do this now. I'm ready. Run, run. I may have, there we go. We made it through it. One of the things that I do like about Metroidvania is now I don't, again, I don't know what's going on with this one, but I would like to see if this is like, you choose your paths and you're gone that way forever whoa or is it a like interlocking so that i can go back around nope i should have watched that i should have known that was there is it interlocking so that i'm now i've got to fall okay that i could wrap back around i'm thinking that nope i was thinking that there might be a special tree in one of those so ugh, that was dumb so is the game interlocking or does it now one of these was a down and i don't recall which one not that one 
Oh, that was dumb. I think it was this one. There we go. Yeah, so is uh, is the whole thing interlocking or is it like one way kind of thing? That's the that's the question I have right now. It wasn't that one. It wasn't that one. Let's see that. There we go. We had to time it right. It's this one, but you got to really be careful about those spikes. They're actually kind of hard to see. There's one right there. I slow down a little bit down through here. Oh, you just go over my head and I don't worry about you. There's two here. Shoot. They're getting tricky on me, trying to get me killed here. All right, so we're going to have to go up and drop. There we go. I like that. Uh, I go oh, a way out. I bet if I floated away to buy upgrades at the bakery, I come back right here. Oh, uh, there we go. But I haven't found. There we go. That's who I wanted to talk to. I beg your pardon. Are you the lost balloon Debuto master waiting to train the hero? Well, well, I think there's a possibility that, you know, <clears throat> I'm the hero. I gotta rescue the other kids, but I'm not really all that strong. I could really use fire magic. He's not gonna say anything at all, is he? Are you all right? You are not the hero. Wait, wait, what? You are not the hero. How do you know this? I have said what needs to be said. Oh, I see. So who's supposed to rescue the other kids then? Uh-oh. <laughs> I smell power. You, balloon with the hat, surrender your magic at once. Leave this place. Hmm, not very likely. I shall take your power by force. On God. Oh, dude. Well, that was rather disappointingly easy. Oh, it went to me. Yeah, I got the fire power. So we got airbag fist. What? Some bad boy stole my fire magic. It's not fair. It was mine. It was coming to me. You don't remember me? Farewell, Hippopotamus. I didn't want that magic anyway. It's far too elementary for my fiendish genius. You keep it, but allow me to leave you with a parting gift. Uh-oh. That's not good. I'm scared. Ta-da! So I got fire magic now. Okay, so I got a punch. Now, can it... Will it hit me if I'm bending down here? That's what I'm thinking. Oh, gosh. Okay. So it's gonna like dodge. Okay. It's gonna like swing at me. I gotta try to stay away from it when it does that. This fire is like hurting it, but very little. So if I could go way over here. Come on, we can do this. It'll take a lot of time to do it this way, but that will be helpful. Okay, come on, we can do this. Ah, look at that. I was good. That's probably what I'm supposed to do is this. Oh gosh. Now I'm stuck at the top. I'm not sure what to do now because that's going to kill me really easily. Maybe we can. Let's try this again. I think I could do this better next time. Oh, I didn't expect to come straight across at me. Okay, we got this. Well, I think I can get him here if I could just hit him enough. Yeah, wow, that was a close one though. Really close. Ha! Take that, you big ugly rock thing. You know, at one point in my life, I, no one would have believed that I could have defeated a floating Mayan skull head. But all it took was a little perseverance, a little resourcefulness, and a whole lot of magic powers. That's kind of the way it is, kid. 
Awesome. So we got fire magic now, which is cool. I would like to go. How many had 200 and 38. I would really like to have the. Uh, oh, no, no, no. I don't want to. I want to go to this. This was my. That fabric had a special. It reduces all damage by 25%. Also has the unpoppable ah, 700. Shoot, that's right. I, yeah, it wouldn't be an upgrade. That one. How much was that? Probably a lot, just 16. Wow, so I'm gonna need a lot more cookies to be able to beat that. But we do have the fire magic, which is good. And some of this now too should be able to, now I could buy this again? Raises your maximum helium level, okay. So I could buy that again if I wanted to. That's kind of neat. Maximum magic, and I think we're okay on this. Strawberry adds maximum health. I really could use that, but again, we're so low on cookies. I would like to actually maybe, I wonder, let's run back up to the Mayan area and check that out. I just want to run through it again really quickly maybe and see what, if we could pick up a few more cookies because it should be a lot easier to just fly through this now. No pun intended. But if we can get that 250 unpoppable, that would be really amazing here. Oh man, I was down to nothing. Now do I lose any cookies? I have 238, that's what I started with when I came in. That's probably you'll lose any of the cookies that you you got in that level or got up to that point or something like that. Let's just go under all those. That shouldn't have been too hard. Can I get that? I want, I, I want, well, there we go. Yeah, this fire magic is gonna make it a lot easier. So I really want to get more help. Well, I, what I want to get is that, I wanna be able to get the How did I make it? Oh, get ah, I don't think I'll make this. Ah, yeah, I was just barely able to do this last time. So this is gonna be tricky here to get through this again. Okay, come on, we can do this. Oh, did it? Oh, oh, so close. I, I could do this, I know I can. Oh, that was not gonna be helpful. We could, uh, we're gonna have to try again. Cause I have to do it like right at, right from the beginning. Okay, watch out for that guy. Go ahead. There we go, we made it through. That's all I need to do and I gotta watch out for the bat. There we go, as long as we can get Another health out of this would be kind of nice, but not necessary. Oh, I can't hit him with the, I gotta bend down with the fire, okay. I just gotta make it to where I can get another. I hope I don't have to fight the guy again. That would be kind of annoying if I have to fight the Mayan mask again. I'm just trying to collect a little bit more cookies here. And it's kind of cool that we it'll let you go back through the levels Hey, there what that's what I wanted. They'll let you go back through the levels and pick up all the cookies again. That's going to definitely help us out. And, and, and in a way that is a is a way to make it easier if you set it up so that you can go through and kind of grind these things. We're almost to the back to the end, I think. Yeah, it was it too much further past this but we do have to go through that mayan area the actual temple area which wasn't really that difficult i don't think i just have to like find the right path again or maybe the path is not as hard as i would have thought it was if i just maybe keep going to the 
right maybe i can get it this this the fire punch definitely makes it a lot easier to get through here oh didn't even see that guy coming okay oh watch out for that uh, spider there didn't want to get a smack down from that spider oh we've got to do the uh rock thing too i forgot all about that that's annoying <laughs> this rock thing a rock challenge here we go it wasn't that difficult really it's just the pressure all of a sudden this new mechanic comes in where you've got a race it definitely gives you the you know the ability to get through there fairly easy but you've got to be ready for it if that makes any sense oh i, for I forgot about these holes again okay now i think it's ah uh, yes it was that one nice oh just keep going keep going keep moving oh no oh wait, where are they Woo -wee. that was close because we don't have any health left to go through here we did get 420 cookies which is nice checkpoint activated so that's the way out the boss or i could just float up to the world map now i don't have to yeah i don't have to fight the boss that makes a lot of sense and we just go back out to the world map and we are oh float away into the world map please yes now i should be able to just be able to float up here and go back to the kingdom of lost balloons and not the armor but if i can get another health i would be really happy that's what i want right there wait what was it what did it do my luscious strawberry adds yeah to your maximum health yes i want that now should that okay that definitely is helpful i wonder if i have another 170 so i could go ahead and up my cookies no i couldn't but i could do my float but that's it i think i'm gonna save it until i get i think i will save it because the next thing i want to do is get that unpopableness which is 700 it's going to take a while to do that but that's going to be our episode for today thank you so much for joining me i really do appreciate it and we're going to be checking out more of this game later on and doing we got to go save some kids here so thank you again for stopping by and spending a little time with me and watching the video and i will see you in the next episode bye everybody